Jazz Hand, fellow interwebians. How are you this fine summer's evening? It is be a beautiful out there. Um, I went to the read through, first read through, read through number one of the play that I'm doing in the summer. Um, so I play a lesbian erotic novelist. There are no words. No words. Stop! Tonight is my big folk scene debut. I am booing myself. Not literally. Uh, I do actually have control over. Anyway, so I'm armed with this. And these. And my vocal cords. And um, video footage of said debut will uh, arrive on your screens presently. Um, I can play seven chords on my guitar now. Um, I can't be bothered to get it out, so I won't show you. You'll just have to trust me. Oh, this is a weird thing. Okay, so I fell asleep today. <coughs> Uh, in front of the computer, lying across my bed, which was strewn with like makeup and stuff. Right, and I woke up and there was like these black smudges all over my bed. None of my clothes, just on my bed, and I couldn't really work out what was going on. And then I went downstairs, and on top of the pile of washing was this, which had a nib like that long this morning. And this was on my bed on its own, the lid. Where's the nib gone? I didn't get smudges on my clothes. I can't see the nib lying on my bed. Where did it go? I might have just found it. No, I don't think I did. It's a mystery, it's a mystery. Anyway. Hi YouTube. Um, I'm wearing sunglasses because they're buff. And I don't want to take them off. Um. They look wonky, but they're not. My eyebrows are wonky, so deal with it, because I have to every single day. Um, so I sang the other day, as I told you I would, and it went really well, and I really enjoyed it. Um, but my video doesn't work. So sadly, I have no proof that it was good, but you'll just have to trust me. And I'll video the next one <coughs> that we do, and hope that my video player doesn't mess it up because it kind of sucks because it sounded really good um, I was a bit annoyed because my voice was really shaky like with nerves and normally like that will last one verse if that and this time it lasted the whole song which was really annoying and I think like it's quite a relaxed environment to sing in really but I think I was sort of thinking they're quite a... what's the word? They're really into their folk music. Discerning, that's the one. They're a discerning audience and I didn't want to... I think I didn't want to offend them or... and also because they've been so excited about us singing I didn't want to disappoint them so I think I was feeling the pressure a bit. Um. Anyway, so my video player... I don't know, the software stopped working or something. Well, the video, I don't know, something went wrong with the video. And then I plugged it into my computer to take the video off the camera. And for some reason, it just, I don't know, it messed it all up. But I've I've reinstalled the software and I've deleted the video and I've formatted the camera. So fingers crossed, um, it'll be fine from now on. Same thing happened to my MP3 player on the same day. What are the odds? Um, so I had to format that and put all the music back on. <sighs> I've had such a nightmare weekend with friggin' technology. And it's only Saturday. Um, yeah, so that's been my week. Um, I'm hoping to meet up with the girls again sometime this weekend. Maybe next week uh, to...
practice some more songs. Because they tell you to do two songs, but in actual fact you should really know at least three because they sometimes ask you to play one that people can join in with. And they asked us, they said, surely you don't just know two songs? And we were like, oh, actually, we only did practice two songs. So we're going to um, hopefully think of some more. We need to think of a name as well. They keep saying, do you have a collective name? We've got a few ideas, but we'll have to narrow them down, I think. Um, what else? My parents are away <clears throat> for the Easter holidays, so there's just the four of us in the house. Um, just the four of us. That's still quite a lot of people. It's me and my big brother and sister and my sister's husband. So we're having a party tonight, um, and then we're going out for Easter dinner tomorrow. Uh, we decided to snub tradition, and we're going for tapas, which will be um, will be good. I'm excited. I like tapas, apart from like calamari and shit. The um, working this evening, Ed Byrne, who is hilarious. I asked a steward, <coughs> which I don't normally do, because stewarding's a bit boring, but I like him, so I asked a steward, and um, I did a show yesterday. I'm doing a show today. I'm quite excited. Uh, I'll put a link, I don't know if he's got a website, I assume he has, but I'll put a link down there if he does, because you should check him out, he's hilarious. Um, yeah, I think that's, that's it, I've got a few vlog ideas brewing, so I'll probably vlog either after work tonight or tomorrow. Um, I want to talk to you about some books and I want to talk to you about things what annoy me because they've been annoying me recently so I thought I'd share and clothes that's always a fun thing to talk about so I've got a few ideas and um yeah so I'll upload this one now and uh see you on the flip side <laughs> <laughs> she fits. I really wish it had a door. I could just you could have shut me in. How long do you think you could stay there before audience members started to realise that you were in there? Twenty minutes. <laughs> Probably. Is it comfy? There's a red wine poking my neck. That's <laughs> not too bad. At least you won't go thirsty. Oh yeah, well, the red ones are disgusting. <laughs> it's like a jet fuel videotape. <laughs> Ta-da! I didn't, like, start. I think my back is too wide. Oh my god! <laughs> Ash, you're really small. <laughs> <laughs> no, you fit, see? It's quite cosy. Not as easy as you do, though. <laughs> I'm, like, touching the top. I don't think you were. Like being born. <laughs>